Greetings, fellow Chamber members. I want to take this opportunity to share with you some of the exciting things that are going on at your Chamber. During last year's municipal election, you shared with us your priorities for Windsor-Essex. You said you wanted economic development and job creation. Our members are making this happen and our municipal leaders have placed it as their top priority. It's now time to focus on our federal representatives and our Chamber team is putting together a comprehensive strategy to make your concerns resonate at the national level. Stay tuned for more as a federal election begins to unfold and watch your inbox for our election survey. We really want to know what you think. Now, I don't know about you, but are you starting to feel the excitement? We've been talking about diversification for some time now, and it's paying off. As a matter of fact, the Conference Board of Canada says Windsor-Essex will have the fastest growing economy in the country this year. That's no surprise to the many of you that are part of our economic engine. Each of you is leading the way with creative strategies, new products, innovative designs, and some homegrown Windsor-Essex tenacity. We want to congratulate the Windsor-Essex Development Corporation for their leadership in spearheading the new regional economic roadmap. This is one of the key components for moving us forward as we diversify and grow this region. They've charged us to take an active role in helping promote the Windsor-Essex region as the best location in Canada to prosper, build, connect, and achieve. We think this makes good sense and we are on board. Finally today, I want to remind you about the upcoming Business Excellence Awards. This year's theme is We Are the Champions and will be held on center ice at the WFCU Center. It's going to be an exciting night and I look forward to seeing each of you there. On behalf of the board and staff, thank you for being part of our chamber, the voice of business in Windsor-Essex.